हेलो स्टूडेंट्स आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू माय चैनल इंजीनियर्स अकेडमी डू हिट द सब्सक्राइब बटन इफ यू हैवन डन इट येट नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम विच सेज दैट असेंड बेग इज ड्रॉप फ्रॉम अ बलून व्हिच इज असेंडिंग वर्टिकली एट अ कांस्टेंट स्पीड ऑफ सिक्स मीटर पर सेकेंड इफ द बेग इज रिलीज विद द सेम अपर्ड विलासिटी ऑफ सिक्स मीटर पर सेकेंड वेन टी को टू जीरो एंड हिट्स द ग्राउंड वेन टी को टू एट सेकेंड determine the speed of the bag as it hits the ground and the altitude of the balloon at this instant so we have to find the speed of the sand bag when it just hits the ground in 8 seconds so this is the balloon and the sand bag is released from the balloon and the balloon is moving with a constant velocity of 6 meter per second in the upward direction and the balloon and the sand bag is released with same upward velocity that is in the upward direction this is let's say 6 meter per second and the sand bags the sand bag takes 8 seconds to hit that ground and then after 8 seconds we have to find uh, the altitude of this balloon so we we need to find the velocity of the bag when it hits the ground so we can use v vf equals to vi plus at and we are assuming that the downward direction is positive so the downward direction is positive so we can say that this is the the vf is the velocity with which the bag hits the ground that is vf and the initial velocity is 6 meter per second in the upward direction so if this is our positive direction so the velocity is in the negative direction so you write minus 6 and the acceleration due to gravity in the downward direction is positive so we will write that this is the Uh, the sand bag uh, will have an acceleration of 9.81 and the time it takes to reach the ground to hit the ground is 8 seconds so this is minus 6 plus 9.81 into 8 this gives us a velocity of 72.48 meter per second so the velocity of the bag when it hits the ground after 8 seconds is 72.48 meter per second and the distance traveled by the sand bag and uh in 8 seconds will be we can write that let's say that uh, the altitude of the sand bag from its initial position is let's say h so we will write that h that will be equal to uh, initial velocity times t plus half g t square so this h initial velocity is minus 6 this is our assumed positive direction so the velocity is in the upward direction so this will be minus 6 into 8 plus 1 divided by 2 g is 9.81 and t is again 8 so this gives us this is minus 6 into 8 plus and 1 divided by 2 is 0.5 multiply by 9.81 multiply by 8 square this gives us 265.92 meters so this is the position this is the altitude of the sand in the altitude of the balloon at that particular instant when the sand bag is released and after 8 second the balloon is also moving in the upward direction so when the bag uh, hits the ground the balloon will not be its original position it uh, it will cover some distance in the upward direction so so its new position will be the balloon will be somewhere here let's say so at this particular point somewhere here the balloon was uh, the sand bag was released now this h is this h is 265.92 now we have to find this distance which is traveled by the balloon from that particular instant when the sand bag is released right so we have to find this h dash so in the problem statement it said that the balloon moves with a constant speed so again we can find h dash so i can write that h dash will be equal to the initial velocity of the balloon times t and that will be plus 1 divided by 2 the acceleration of the balloon times t square now the acceleration of the balloon is zero since it is moving with a constant speed in the upward direction so this acceleration is zero so we can find h dash this will be equal to vit so vi is 6 and 6 into 
and this is we can write this as minus 6 right so this is minus 6 into 8 is minus 48 meters so the minus tells us that the balloons travel the distance in the upward direction so the downward direction is positive so the distance traveled in the upward direction is 48 meters now the altitude of the balloon from the ground will be equal to h plus h dash so we can write that the final height of the balloon will be equal to h plus h dash which will be equal to 265.92 plus 48 so this is 265.92 plus 48 this gives us 313 Point nine two meters so this is the altitude of the balloon after eight seconds when the when the sand bag hits the ground and the velocity of the of the sand bag when it hits the ground is 72.48 meter per second so this is the solution of this particular problem i hope this will help you in your learning do subscribe engineers academy for the solution of such more problems from hibler dynamics